guys, in today's video we're going to take a look at what are alkenes, bonding in alkenes, looking at the shape of alkenes, stereoisomerism in alkenes, an exam style question, and finally a summary. So let's begin by having a look at what are our alkenes. Well, our alkenes are similar to our alkanes, but there are some marked differences. Just like our alkanes, our alkenes are hydrocarbons. And what we mean by that is that they contain only carbon and hydrogen atoms. However, an important difference between our alkanes and our alkenes are that our alkenes are unsaturated. And by that we mean they contain at least one carbon to carbon double bond. Our alkenes form a homologous series and they have a general formula of CnH2n where n represents the number of carbon atoms in our molecule. So if we take a look at some of our alkenes, we can look at their structure and take a look at their formula. So here we have a molecule of ethene and we can see that double carbon to carbon bond there. Ethene contains one, two carbon atoms, meaning that N will be equal to two. So we can calculate the number of hydrogen atoms that we'd expect in a molecule of ethene. That's two times two, giving us four hydrogen atoms, which we can indeed count here in our molecule, meaning the formula of ethene will be C2H4. If we move on to have a look at a molecule of propene, we can see propene has one, two, three carbon atoms. And we can observe that double carbon to carbon bond over here. So N will be equal to three, and we can predict that there will be three times two, that is six hydrogen atoms. So the formula will be C3H6. Looking at a molecule of butene, we can see we have one, two, three, four hydrogen atoms. So N is equal to four, and therefore four times two, we will have eight hydrogen atoms. So we have a formula of C4H8. And again, we can locate that double carbon to carbon bond that exists over here. Now, as we know, as is true of our homologous series, our alkenes have similar chemical and physical properties. I will observe a gradation in the physical properties of our alkenes. So now we've taken a look at an introduction to our alkenes, let's have a look at the bonding that we observe within our alkenes. So as I mentioned, our alkenes are hydrocarbons. They contain only carbon and hydrogen atoms. So if we first of all take a look at the covalent bonds between our carbon and hydrogen atoms. These are what we call sigma bonds. They involve the direct overlap of the electron cloud of our carbon and hydrogen atoms. And using ETH. Hey guys, to continue watching this video and unlock hundreds of other super concise and exam board specific A level chemistry videos, just click the Snap Provide smiley face. Join me today and together let's make A level chemistry a walk in the park. 